Hello, Internet! I'm Amstamom, and you are watching some more Undertale Massacre style. But, uh, we are now standing in front of what might be our first ever boss in the game. And I don't even know if we're ready yet. We have leveled up to level three. Love three. Uh, but still, are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out so loud repeatedly, pretending to sleep. I love Nabs, not blue! Moving with force. God, this is gonna be a yes. Oh shoot, this forces you into the fight. Here comes Nabsta Luke. Oh gosh, here we go. Boom! Slap! Uh nyar, nyar. I forget your attacks. Oh yeah, you're you're crying. Oh dear. Oh gosh, how am I supposed to dodge that one? Nabsta Luke is pretending to sleep. Bam! Even his music's pretty cool. Just plugging along. Really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. Oh god, do I have to kill him like this? He's not even fighting back, wishing they weren't here. Bam! Oh, I'm fine, thanks. Oh gosh. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Okay, absolutely good staring into the distance. Looks like we're definitely leveled up enough. Bam! Um, you do know you can't kill ghosts, right? We're sort of incorporeal and all. I was just lowering my HP because I didn't want to be rude. Sorry, I just made this more awkward. Pretend you beat me. All right, woo. You won, you lost one experience, but oh, come on. So that was, that was what I was supposed to do though, right? I was supposed to kill him. What was the other way? Is that the spider bake sale? Oh gosh, I don't know if I'm supposed to do this. Spider bake sale, all precedes go to real spiders. Okay, see the... Mm. If I have to kill everybody, I have to make sure I don't pay for this to get to the spider bake sale. I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe I should... Um, I gotta check a spoiler-free thing to make absolutely sure I do all the right stuff. Give me a sec here. Okay, I'm back. So I think my suspicions were right. We actually don't want to do that just on the off chance we do get to fight... Um, I think it was Muffet, the spider boss lady. Um, did you miss it? Spider bake sale down to the right. I'm going to ignore it. In in the chance that I get to kill everything. Ribbit, ribbit, sigh. My friend never listens to me. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. That's right, X. Oh, not you too. Yeah, I tried to do it that time because the other time before he uh, listened, he uh, was upset with you. So, here we go. Hello. Just realized that it's been a while since I've cleaned up was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday you might see something you really like. Ah, okay, so, now, what uh, I basically got from the... I found a spoiler-free uh, tutorial, very brief, on what you're supposed to do. And, um, you do want to keep doing random encounters before you find the boss. Yes, that is true. But, um, there's also monsters down here. There's a set amount of monsters in every area, and you must kill all of them. Like this guy. Vegetoid came out of the earth. Fight Vegetoid. Bam! You must kill absolutely everyone. Farmed locally. Very locally. Oh gosh, I ran right into that one. Oh god! Ow! Vegetoid cackles. Bam! We gotta heal after this. Contains vitamin A. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm okay. Alright. Vegetoid seems kind of dead. Bam! Nice. You won, earned six XP and one gold. Not doing that well, am I? Um, I think I can fight another monster here before, uh, kind of dying here. Uh, what's this? You found a faded ribbon. Ooh, is that an item? Um, let's see. Item, faded ribbon. Use? You equipped it the ribbon. Nice. Uh, stat, what is that? Uh, the faded ribbon. I don't know what that does. My attack is, uh, four. It's not zero. My defense is three. Gosh, that's terrible. Um, maybe that's important? I don't know. But hey, I didn't even know that was there the first time. So, whatever it does, I've got it. Um, hey, a button. There you go. Well, now I can get out of here at the very least, but, uh, not really what I was aiming for. I'm aiming for death and carnage. Oh, hey, hey, random encounter. Here we go. Ooh, a mus- a me gosp. I didn't even see that me gosp yet. I'm gonna kill the mod small first. Bam! Boom! I think they take two shots. Slime grounds. Hide the swarm. Whoa! Shoot! Mossmall waits pensively. 
And eyes. Bam. Oh, swing your arms, baby. Oh, yeah, I forgot he just dances. Why didn't he do that attack last time? Uh, Migas doesn't have a care in the world. He will now! Why do I need to kill everything? Lala, just be yourself. Okay. I feel so bad. This is awful. He's not fighting me, and I'm killing him. Dead. You won. You earned 8 XP and 7 gold. We'll level up eventually, right? So I guess it's okay. Hey. Yay. Let's kill this Vegetoid down here. I could never figure out how to spare these guys either, so I feel kind of bad I didn't 100% the sparing part, but whatever. Doesn't bother me that much. Bam! Also, apparently there were a lot of areas that I had never found. Part of a complete breakfast. Um, which I feel kind of bad about that, but it's all up to chance, you know, if I figure it out or not. I'm gonna try and find the rest of the stuff this time, so bear with me, guys. Like I said, I am still playing this very much blind. Um, whoa. I don't want to be spoiled by any of this. This toy seems kind of bruised. Oh. And now he's dead. You weren't, you were in six XP and one gold. Well, I gotta fall on the top one here, so. Maybe there's a Y on a counter here that I missed? No, there's nothing here. Okay, so, I guess I can continue. I don't remember where I need to get for, uh, yeah, there's a lot more to go. Okay, this is good. Um, this one's just open. Now this one, it says push like, what block was this one? You can read this, press the blue switch, which is hidden behind like up here, I think. It's a switch, press it, yes. Hear a clicking sound. There we go. Nice. Now, hopefully, we're gonna find more wild encounters. Oh, I need a, I need a healing save station. Cause um, I'm not doing so hot. Hmm. I don't know which switch opens this one. Give me a hint here. You can read this. Press the red switch. Absolutely, I can do that. Oh, I think those uh, big eyeball guys are in here. They might be a little stronger. Not sure if I'm ready for that. Hopefully, we can get to the next save point. I'll be okay though. Um. This was kind of a random crapshoot, wasn't it? It's a switch, press it. I think the, the one on the other side drops you in a hole. Hear a clicking sound. All right, cool, I'm good. Does that absolutely... Does that kill monsters by falling in that pit? I don't remember. This is the end of it. So actually, I never found those guys, but I think there's a safe station very, very close to here. There is, however, a sword right here that I want found the toy knife. <laughs> I found the toy knife. <laughs> you equipped the toy knife. Uh, let me look at my stats. Oh, yummy, yummy. In my tummy. I have a very slightly higher attack. Oh, and it's dreadful. It's dreadfully powerful. And I'm coming back for you, my pretties. Actually, there's a save station up here if I just kind of, you know, run up here and save and run back and then murder everyone. Looks longer than I thought it would. Um, I think this is still safe for me to do this. How did you get here, my child? I think I can, like, not go in the house and save. There, there, I will heal you. Ah, uh, thank you. Should not have left you alone for so long. I was, uh, irresponsible to try and surprise you like this. Err! Uh, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. I only will for a little bit. I want to heal and save and run right back and murder everyone. Seeing a cute house in the, uh, whatever. I'm determined. Yeah, and all that stuff. And a dead tree. Alright, so, basically, there's no more monsters inside there. What I want to do is come back here, fall in this hole. Because one, there was a hole. Yep, there's a hole. Okay. And fight everything I can possibly find. Um, not really seeing any, finding any monster encounters in here. Ah. I, I know this was the place where I found those, uh, big eyeball guys. And, um, we gotta kill those. If we don't kill them, then... What's the point? What's the point of life if I can't kill everybody? Come on, game. Give me them. It doesn't seem to want to give me these guys to fight and kill. I'm gonna run in circles, I guess, until I can find and kill them, so... Give me a bit, guys. Finally! Jeez Louise, that took forever. Oh my gosh, I was just running back and forth for so long. Oh my gosh. Let's kill these guys. Bam! Oh, it's uh, getting faster. Obey the Overmind. Oh god. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, subtle movement speeds them. 
Oh, not enough. Yeah, well, came from the other direction. I wasn't prepared for that. Fresh morning taste. Maybe it's because I got the uh, knife and it goes faster or something like that. Not like steamed carrots and peas. Vegetoid. Bam! Nice, I'm doing more damage though. Part of a complete breakfast. So, it's weird that I find these guys. I wasn't expecting to see them. What's weird is that, um... I did not see the eyeball guys. I was really expecting to find them instead. So, the encounter rate must either be really, really low... Or there's, like, no monsters left. There's gotta be more, though. I would think so. I don't know. I guess I gotta keep doing this again until I find some more encounters. Um, be right back. Oh! Yes! Yes, finally! I was waiting for you guys. Para looks decided to pick on you. Well, dead. They're dead. I don't care. Don't pick on me. Please don't pick on me. I'm not picking on you. I'm murdering you. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Forgot how bad I was at this. Looks is gazing at you. Bam! Looks is dead! What an eyesore. Prepare to be dead, looks. Oh. Looks is staring and looks is dead. Die, looks. What an eyesore. All sorts of death is happening today. Looks gnashes its teeth. Boop! Dead. You won and leveled up to level four. All right, nice. Okay, cool. Fortunately, monsters are still spawning. I was getting really scared, actually, that um, by talking to Toriel, um, somehow all the monsters decided to stop fighting you, and um, she's protecting you or something like that, and I already screwed up my run. So little things like that are kind of worrying me. Fortunately, though, monsters still appeared here. So what I need to do is basically keep doing this until I get a certain message. I don't remember what the message is, but it's going to basically give me the idea that all the monsters are gone. There's nothing left here. But, um... There's still no way to tell. Here we go. Vegetoy came out of the earth. Alright, so I gotta keep fighting these guys. I'm not sure what level we're actually going to get to. Uh, but remember, this is all the experience we're going to get for fighting Toriel. And we aren't getting the chance to spare her this time. We have to kill her. That's coming soon. Contains vitamin A. <laughs> oh boy, so wonderful! So wonderful! Kill Vegetoid. Boom! I have a lot of HP too. It feels nice. Farmed locally. I wish I could have figured out how to spare you, man. I feel bad that I didn't. Boop! And that kills him. 46. Man, that is nice. I'm getting a lot more uh, XP and gold now too. Which is, um... Is the gold useful? Who's gonna sell money to this murdering kid? I'm running around with a knife. I wish I was getting covered in blood or something. I don't know. Maybe I'm really getting into the murder part. <laughs> Kill everybody. It's my inner Metal Gear Solid 3 coming out. If you guys saw that Let's Play, oh my goodness. Murdering psychopath me. Yeah, you, you want to see that. That's... Oh, that game's fun. The game's really fun. But still, murdering everybody in Undertale is going to be just as fun. I love sticking it to the man, especially when I'm sticking it with a knife. See you guys in the next encounter. Here we go! Whoa. But nobody came. Oh, that's so creepy. Oh, it's wrong. Oh, make the music stop. Determination. That's it. Oh, God. Make the music stop. <laughs> Do you smell that? Surprise. The butter guy's gonna die. Then we might celebrate your arrival. We'll have a nice time. I killed everybody out there. So hold off a snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Now, I never tried going down the stairs when she did this. In this part, I'm gonna try going down the stairs already. Nah, she stops me. Hey, do not go down here. I have something to show you upstairs. Alright, well, if everything's gonna be the same, I'm just gonna go through the stuff and I'll see you guys in the next different part of the game. Oh, gosh, stop. Stop talking to me like that. I have to kill you. Going to have to. Oh. 
Oh, did you want something? What is it? How can I go home? What? This this is your home now. Um, ah, it's not different, but I just couldn't help it. So I did the same thing as last time. Basically, went to bed, got the pie, and I really should have ran after her in hindsight, but I forgot. She's trying to distract me. She just wants me to stay. How do I exit the ruins? Um, how about an exciting snail fact? Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems into immature? Interesting. How do I get out of here? I have to do something. Stay here. And so do we, and we know exactly what that something is. I'm going this way. Determination. I'm saving first. Because Toriel is down here. And we have to kill her. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. You know, it's actually a shame that, uh, you only get a set amount of XP in this game, so you really can't level grind. You just realize that. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they... Asgore will kill you. I will kill everyone. I'm only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. Nope. Nope. Murder. Do not try to stop me. It's your final warning. I am just here to kill you. That's all it is. Don't tell me about how you want to grow up and be a teacher and, and, and you want to protect the people and you really just want to save me and I'm here to kill you. Do you want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Toriel blocks the way. And she dies. Now. Fight Toriel! Boom! Holy... You... You... Really... Hate me that much? Wow! I didn't think I was going to hurt her that much. Now I see who I was protecting by keeping you here. Not you, but them. Ha. Ha. What? What? Oh. Well, that wasn't even much of a boss fight. She just kind of went kablooey. Oh, dear. Well. Ugh. Maybe it was like some lucky critical hit one-shot thing, and I bypassed the fight. But sad. Kind of sad. They didn't, they didn't rub in my nose in it too much. Hey, Flowey. What do you got to say about this? Love murder? You're not really human, are you? No. You're empty inside. Just like me, in fact. You're ham, sir, right? We're still inseparable after all these years. What? Listen. I have a plan to become all-powerful. Even more powerful than you and your stolen soul. Am I teaming up with Fla- Wait, you and your stolen soul? Uh, this is starting to make sense now. Let's destroy everything in this wretched world. Everyone, everything in these worthless memories. Let's turn them all to dust. That's a wonderful idea! Huh? That's a wonderful idea! What a jolly good time we will have, murdering all upon the world. Everyone shall die by Toby Fox. <laughs> oh, what a wonderful idea. I'm prepared. Do you have to kill everybody in the towns too? Is that possible? Oh, no. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. Oh gosh, I have to fight Sans. But remember, if Toriel never got a chance to talk to Sans, walk around the stick. 
I can see through this tree. Just saying. Anyway, um, but if Toriel never talked to Sans, she would have she would never have stopped him, or he would have never have stopped from killing me right now. Is Sans gonna fight me right now? I couldn't even save. Step by right there. He stops and gets me. Can I run? I can't move. Human. Don't. You know. Boom. How to greet up new pal. Turn around and shake my hand. Is he still a jokester? Yes. Okay. I thought for sure. The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Oh, jeez. I thought for sure that he was going to try and kill me here. That's, that's, uh, your cue to laugh. Or, uh, too emote at all. Gee, lady, you really know how to pick him up. Oh, that's different. Because I am a different person, I don't laugh, I'm, I am not amused. And he's saying lady as in Toriel. Okay, that's fine, everyone's got their own sense of humor. I'm Sans. Oh, right, she still would have told him because she only realized I was gonna kill her at that very last second. Sans is skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you yeah, know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. So I guess consistently throughout the whole game, everything's gonna be different, which is weird. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey. Actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. I'm gonna hide by that uh, conveniently be, uh, placed lamp. Now, this is all gonna be the same. I'm gonna skip past this stuff until we get something new. See you guys in a bit. Uh, wait, I guess you don't have to. Oh! Never mind, that is different. You're supposed to hide in the normal run. What's this? You found a human yet? Yeah. Really? Wowie! Guess that's settled. That worked out, huh? What? Okay! Are you just gonna stare at me, or...? Right. Okay, then. Well, that's strange. Very, very strange. Whoa, didn't know I could do that. Well, I'll be straightforward with you. My brother would really like to see a human. So, you know, it really helped me out. He kept pretending to be one. Oh. He doesn't... Oh. 16. What? What does that mean? Is that how many monsters I need to kill? And the game knows I'm killing now. It's fishing a lot of fish to the ground. Reeled in. Yes. I'm gonna do that. I don't, attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decided not to call. Uh, I am finally getting the game. Use the box. I'm gonna say yes. I'm gonna store uh, stuff that we definitely don't need to see in it. Wait. Ooh. The tough glove is in the box. So if I take that out, I can actually use that, correct? So I'm not using the stick and the bandage anymore. I'm gonna put those back and uh, check what the tough glove does. Um, let's see, because I really don't remember that one. Tough glove use. Go to tough glove. Oh, you know, I should have uh, item... Okay, so it is a weapon. The toy knife is an alternative version. Toy knife weapon attack three made of plastic a rarity nowadays. And as opposed to... No, 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 no. As opposed to item, let's use the knife so that I can read about this. Tough glove, I'm gonna attack five. Okay, so you want the tough glove. Um, item, tough glove, use this. Now I know what I'm doing. All right, now put this back. Use the box. Yes, I'm gonna put the knife back. The knife is pretty much just for killing Toriel. Cute. Uh, wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. So, oh, with that, we gotta get going. Sam, so, yes, what's that human showing up? I wanna look my Sunday best. Or at least my Tuesday pretty good. Don't you only have the one outfit? Yeah, but I could style my hair. <laughs> oh, right, good idea. Say, why don't you look over there? 
Papyrus' theme is great. Burn, 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 bum, 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 bum. And lots of double takes. Till eventually we're spinning in circles and nothing happens. Okay. Sans! Oh my god! I'm dizzy! What am I looking at? <laughs> Behold! A rock. Oh my god! Why are you telling me to look at a rock? Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! I have no idea what that is! Well, it's uh, not a rock. Not a rock. Oh no! By process of elimination, that means it's a human! Ahem. Human! Prepare yourself for high jinx! For low jinx! Dangers, puzzles, capers, jeepers! Being captured and other sorts of fun activities, refreshments will be provided. If you dare! <laughs> and you don't even bat an eye, huh? Oh. It's because this is a different character who's just like... You observe the well-crafted center station. Who could have built this? You ponder. I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not a very famous royal guardsman. Our first new deaths. The snow drake flutters in. Alright. Death to you. Boop. Press Z. My, fa my fave ice crisp cereal's frosted. Whoa. Wasn't really expecting that. I have to attack twice. Smells like a wet pillow. Do I have to attack him multiple times? Favorite ice cereal's frosted. Okay, so I guess I gotta fight him multiple times. Maybe I smash it. That's the wet glove thing. Oh, bam! Ice puns are no problem. Okay, I can do this. Oh, it's the comedian. Oh, flaking apart. Boom! You won. You're in 22 XP and 18 gold. Murder everybody. Absolutely no moving. Oh, now here is a boss fight. That actually is a straight up boss fight right there. And I'm kind of thinking, because it's been a while, we've done a lot this episode. I'm actually going to go back. I'm going to finish this first to kill the ice cap. Boom! Oh, I'm so good. I'm going to go back here and hit uh, this 14 left. That is what it is. It knows what I'm doing now. It knows I'm here for murder. Might as well kill the lesser dog and go back and save again. Because we have a boss fight coming up next. And maybe we're actually going to level up with this lesser dog. Boom! Oh, can't quite kill him. Pant, pant. Oh, it's so cute! Ow! Lesser dog tucks in its tail between its legs. Die, lesser dog! Earned 18 and 15 gold. I feel so bad. I feel so bad. 13 left. Oh, God. <laughs> but we've got a boss fight next time. Can I get to them? I didn't even know you can get uh, encounters in this area, too. Here we go. Guys, are we ready to take on another boss? Oh, gosh. This is painful. I kept trying to convince myself that there's so long. This isn't going to hurt. This is going to be fine. I could do this. Oh. It's only gonna get harder. Oh. oh. It's only gonna get harder. Let's see what happens. Not only to the other characters, but apparently to us. We are becoming very void, if you're noticing. They're saying different things like, you have no emotions, do you? It's pretty terrifying, but either way. That is all the time we have for now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like the videos and subscribe for more, and I will see you all in the next episode of Undertale. Boop.